Alrighty, folks, so we're gonna give the uh, the Stellar Blade demo a shot here. I've seen a couple of trailers for this one. It looks pretty interesting. I'm kind of intrigued. I want to see what kind of what the uh, what the game's about. I'm glad there's a demo so I can dive into it a little bit. I'm just gonna jump right into it. Uh, I don't know very much about this game at all. Okay, space fights, space battles. Are we entering an atmosphere? Tell me of it. I want to know everything. Help! Oh God, something. Oh God, they're shooting us. Okay, never mind. We're trying to go to the we're trying to go to the planet. <laughs> Some Star Trek stuff. Hey, that shield doesn't seem to have worked. It's looking bad. Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh-oh. If we're going down, we're going down with a fight. Send all our people down there. Sounds great. I noticed that on the uh, on the home screen too. The music was really great. No, it just came out. So the demo just came out today. So no, I've never played it before. It'll be a first time. Thanks for the GGs. Although sending that after all of her friends just perished was probably a call, but that's a choice. Removing physical shield. Opening hatch. Okay. So my understanding is that we're controlling Eve. Come on. Come on. Ooh. Hey, the hatch isn't working. T Tucky. Hello. Eve, are you all right? Nope. This place is dangerous. Are you dangerous? Take my hand. <laughs> Why was there water? <laughs> okay. Water armor? It is very dramatic, yeah. Triangle for strong. Nice. I want to guard. Okay. I see you still have your combat senses. I wouldn't go that far. <laughs> I'm sure she's fine. I'm sure she's fine. Space Bayonet, it does kind of seem that way, yeah. A lock on. Got him. Fight me. Cool. When you hit an enemy or parry an enemy's attack, beta energy is charged, okay? My body frame. Take this. It's first aid. Okay. My body frame? Hold the select potion, use potion. Use potion. Done. Very chaotic this start. Press all three is great. Okay. Watch out for gardeners interception. Dodge. Don't stop. Keep moving. Eve. What? What did you think I was doing? <laughs> okay. Did we make it? This isn't looking good. Let's go. <laughs> He's got like bowling balls for hands. An Alpha Natiba. An Alpha Natiba. Ooh. Look out! Damn, that scream sounded real. Now it's her other arm. Her her other body frame. <laughs> Life signs. Sheesh. Sad. We're the only two left. We're in. Let's do it. Oh. Oh. Naturally. Eve, are you ready? Not really. 
if I'm being honest with you, but I'll try my best. A brute. Oops. Gotcha. Ooh. Re attack. I'm hurt. I have another potion? Sick. Ow. Ow. Yellow camp lock, got it. <laughs> that win? Sick. <laughs> that was dope. <laughs> Cool. Breathing, that's a good sign. That is part of the process. But it was a strong one. Okay. You fought well. Even better than during training. You were all together. Thanks. But then... And now we're not. Sad. The damage to your body frame is serious. Oh, so the body frame is the armor then. Okay. We have to find the supply camp. This is just the beginning Wait, of the game, too. That's wild. I hear something. Eve! Eve, are you alright? I'm like a solid 3 out of 10, Tacky. That looks bad. Oh. Gross. <laughs> okay. Now what? Is she gonna fight him on her own? Yeah, I'm sure she'll be fine. Here, friend. It's me. Okay, maybe not. Maybe she's not fine. Oh my god, dude. Uh oh. Eve. Get out of here. That's bad. Ducky! So, hey, that's the intro. <laughs> cool. Okay. That's wild. It's quiet. Too quiet. Still, make sure to stay cautious. This is like sometime after, I'm assuming. I don't know if it was like behind my face cam or something. Maybe it said like two years later or something, but. What we got? Where are we? Who are we? Well, we're Eve. But... Hello? Now, get ready. I'll be supporting with the drone. Thanks, Adam. Well, Adam and Eve. Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm-hmm. Sure. Sure. <laughs> so this must be 
must be 807. 807? Yes. This was the final battlefield of civilization. Dang. It was also known as a truly colossal city. Hmm. You know, it's uh it's up in the air right now, but I think your Something your is uh guess is probably correct. A strange sensation. Doesn't know what rain is? This must be Earth's rain. We can admire the scenery later. We have a job to do here. <laughs> Tell me about it, Adam. Okay. Silent Street. Scavenger Adam. The item that Adam asked for is in the Hall of Records. Go to the Hall of Records following the drone controlled by Adam. Okay. Data Bank. Atiba. Okay, so oh okay, so this is like a beast area then. Cool. So like a breakdown? Like can you Oh cool. So you can actually like read into what you, each of them are. So this these are thorn heads. Thorn heads are Natibas with thorny heads that are long, fragile bodies. It's not known if they have organs or for seeing or hearing, and little has been discovered about the biology. It is certain, however, that they attack in small groups. Thornheads are not overly intimidating enemies. They can be easily taken down from the front. Okay. Beholders and Atibas with gruesomely twisted bodies, sporting a bone saw blade on one arm. Their shape makes it difficult to distinguish their characteristics. However, when they stare at you with their beady, piercing yellow eye, it is easy to see why some of them call them some call them watchers. Beholders attack by slashing with their bone saw blades. Stay calm and fight back against them. Easy enough. And this was an elite Natiba. Natiba are clearly adaptable creatures. At first, it was believed they were simply quick to mutate. However, when the enormous brutes ripped up open the machine cores to, uh, to attach them to their tentacles and draw energy, we realized that the Natiba's evolutionary evolutionary potential was limitless. Brutes are beasts with superhuman power. Be careful of their aggressive attacks that span wide areas. When a brute is enraged, it overloads its machine core. Overloaded cores turn bright yellow and cause explosions. Oh, okay, so that was what happened before then, I think. Brutes' explosive attacks come in a variety of forms, including continuous explosions, shockwaves, and ground blasts. Keep your distance and act fast. That did not happen. Never mind. Never mind. That did not happen. Okay. And then these are just all the skills and stuff that we learned, which we already learned. Um, how to rush. The beta skills. Items, just potions. Okay. Alrighty, cool. Falling debris. Be careful, Lee. Oh, you can break this stuff open. Nice. This is the legion that was killed in the final war. Investigate. Passcode. Ra ra ra. <laughs> roa roa. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh gosh. It's a security code. A type of entry permit. Okay. So we'll have to find like the locked door that that goes in then. Easy enough. Oh, this is probably the locked door that it goes in. Try entering the cove. Roa, roa. Oh, it was the slower case, huh? My bad. My bad. Hold on. Oh, they switched the spots. Uh, roa, roa. Got him. Open says me. Because of the city's unstable terrain. You'll get used to it soon. Will I? Can I swim? I can. Ooh, what's this? Materials, nice. Music's fun. Boop. Got him. There's a legion camp in a place like this. A legion camp. That's supposed to mean something to me, Adam. Camps are places are, are places where you can save your progress and get some rest. You can activate them by obtaining Vit coins found near camp. Sit down at chairs and camps to recover HP and refill a rechargeable tumbler. Your stored items will be retrieved if space is available. Some enemies will be revived when resting at the camp. Okay, so kind of like a campfire from like the Souls games then. Use the vending machine at the camp to purchase items. You can learn or train skills through the kiosk. Okay, what? I just have to do this? Activate? <laughs> Cute. <laughs> All right, skill settings. You can learn a new skill. Press R2 to change the survival tree. Learn perfect dodge. Where's perfect dodge? Here. Completely evades enemy attacks. Upon successful perfect dodge, press triangle to perform an additional attack. Ooh. So hold X to learn. Dodging at the perfect moment will activate perfect dodge and allow you to avoid danger. Nice. And then I don't really need to heal, but I guess we'll um, 
Oh, we can change the song? Fun. I like that. Have a seat. Maybe I shouldn't have had a seat. It's just a little camping sesh. Oof. Why do I get the feeling this is gonna be some like, oh. Gonna be some Mega Man crap where they like turn zero into the bad guy. Stay alert, Eve. I'll try my best, Adam. Thank you, Adam. So it looks like they're going to fill in the gaps with those flashbacks. The music kind of gives me Final Fantasy 13 vibes. Which isn't a bad thing. I like Final oh, Fantasy 13's music quite a bit. <laughs> Get a potion. Oh, okay. So I got a different potion. So compatibility shouldn't be an issue. Rechargeable tumbler and restores a lot of HP. Continuously. So this is like regen. And then instantly restores HP, but it's a highly concentrated. Okay. Right on. Cool. Oh, nice. That actually mattered? How many of those things could I have broken open before? I guess that was the first time I noticed it, so maybe I didn't miss anything up until this point. Not that I'm super worried about it anyways, but... Hey, oh. Be careful. Oh! You see the rapids below. <laughs> that was close. Oh, surely we'll make it, right? Yeet. Cool. Yeet. Got it. Easy. I do have to press R2 when I run over those little glowy things on the ground. And if I don't do that, I don't get the item. So I need to be careful with that. Press triangle in the air to strike. Sick. That's cool. Enemies maintain their stance with balance. Balance is displayed below the HP and shield gauges. Okay. You can knock enemies off balance by performing a perfect parry. Enemies that are completely off balance become groggy. Use retribution to deal massive damage, okay? Hmm. I was trying to do the dodge thing there. And it said I just got got. <laughs> F, dude. All right, try again. Then rush. Potions are pretty seamless, which is nice. Fight me, nerd! Oh, he got me. <laughs> Never mind, he got me. Okay, so the um, the rush only has like a pretty small range, honestly. Okay, there we go. I think the big thing that's gonna hurt me is trying to remember to actually like press R two to pick up the items that are falling on the ground. Omni bolt. Use the material for expanding gear sockets. Nice. Oh, I got new gear. Gear is equipment that can improve Eve's combat abilities. You can equip gear and gear sockets to boost your desired combat capabilities. Dope. You can access gear sockets at the equipment tab by pressing the buttons. Yep, 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 yep. Okay. So, equipment, gear, combo enhancement gear. Combat attack power level 2 or higher plus 14%. Okay. Yes, please. Thank you. Yeah, for sure. It seems like it's a lot of fun. All right, so one thing that we absolutely have no choice but to find out is if there's fall damage, so. Seems like yes. <laughs> Seems like yes. Or get forced into a cutscene. Stuff! It's a trap. It feels like a trap. Now what, Adam? We're surrounded. Uh-oh. Okay.
Did we get them all? How did they survive? Okay. Uh oh. It's a tarp. This feels unfair. Hey, I'm trapped. Excuse me. Okay, so yellow attacks can't be guarded. Got it. Uh oh. Hey, hold on. Wait. All right. I'm trying to test how like quick the uh, parry system works. go that way but I don't want to there are traces of markers left behind by the leap got to be a way to get over there yeah stuff would you just take that person's life what just happened there may your memories live on forever Oh, okay. Those are beta cores. So you take that person's beta energy and then you turn it into more beta energy after you find three. Little upgrade system. I like that. That wasn't the code that we needed to open up that chest, though. What about you, homie? Just SP. I'm so brave. <laughs> oh God! Oh no! Am I brave or dumb? Let's see, little yellow. Decades have passed. Ooh, my camera's kind of in the way. Decades have passed since the appearance of Natibas and the evacuation of humankind to the colony. They say the airborne squad is descending to rescue the remaining humankind, but there is no sign. We can't do this anymore. I can't do this anymore. Passcode! Woo! Memory sticks to Okay. You have to cross here. Do you see the ladder behind me? Yes. How how do you would you like me to do that with what looks like garbage? Can I like grab it? That went well. <laughs> right back in the water we go. There we go. We got enough SP to get another skill. Aerial blow. Hits the enemy in the air and then lands. Ignores the enemy's guard. Okay, so that actually does like a dive attack though. I thought I was thinking like a knock them up in the air, like Devil May Cry style. That is not the case. Increases the charging distance and attack power of Rush. I actually like that. Because right now Rush doesn't feel like it goes very far. I think we're going to do the uh, the rush increase, because um, that just feels good. That just feels good. And then we'll have a rest so I don't lose all of my uh, my life again. Uh, I'm guessing this is where we're supposed to go. So let's go fight this enemy real quick. This looks like a new one. Uh-oh. I'm surprised when I perfect parry, it doesn't, like knock him off guard or something the barnacle this was pretty self-explanatory so you had to like get behind him the, the hard part about that was trying to figure out how to get behind him like effectively because even when i was getting the perfect dodges i never really found a time to like 
sneak behind him. And the hitbox for their shield is very forgiving for them, not for me. Hmm, not very. Oh, it has cooldown, okay. You see that in the bottom right above my uh, skill bar there? That's the rush cooldown. I think they knew it was a pretty good skill. Stuff! Nice. What do you got? The network has been destroyed. I'm completely disconnected from the colony's data link. We have nowhere to fall back to. This is what Atiba's doing. Is the colony safe? What happened to Mother Sphere? I lost track of time since even that won't automatically correct itself. For the sake of my own sanity, I must keep track of the calendar by force editing my memory stick. We got enough. Oh, that's right. This is a shop, isn't it? Forgot about that. What do you got? Look at all this money. Resets the skill tree and refunds all SP. Nice. Let me think so heart. Shock grenades makes nearby enemies collapse. That seems pretty useful. Just da or damages the enemy's shield. Okay. Lingering potions we found are pretty decent. Um. I guess we'll just save the money for now. I don't think we really need those just yet. Let's just max out the rush. The rush feels pretty strong. I feel like it, we'd be fools not to not to level that up. And I, oh, man, the fall damage is not forgiving in this game. Okay, let's go ahead and put the battery here. Yeet. Opens up the door for us. What do we got? Hello. A piano. Oh, looks like this used to be a library. Are these boxes displayed on the wall storage devices? Sort of. They can only store up to one megabyte of data. What a waste of resources. Damn. Damn. <laughs> a waste, huh? Eve is protected by a shield. Eve has damage reduction while the shield is active and the damage reduction effect increases as the shield protection level increases. Protection level decreases after each time the shield takes a certain amount of damage. Okay. Some enemies are also protected by a shield. Enemies have damage direction while the shield is active. Destroy the shield to stun the enemy. Oh, so it wanted me to, like, keep hitting it. Okay. Oh shit, there's a second one. chest Adam what is this don't you know this already it's a map, it's a, map. a map how do you synchronize the location on the map <laughs> Plastic Cars, Volume 3. Oh, it's like a play? My love, wait. One, two, three, two, two, three. Try to do a little better. You said you danced with two. For whom does the rose smile with me? I know I did, but can we go a little slower? With beauty, with grace, just as we were born. My little treasure, I am a hacking device. Cyberspace is my realm. I don't know how to dance like this. <laughs> right, right. You're dangerous and cute and weak. There, I won. Quickly now, quickly. Sh should I lick the plug? My dear mother's fear, please forgive your sinful daughter. Oh, Lord. Anyway. <laughs> hey, 
anyway, I feel like I should just be mashing R2 as I'm walking around. I don't know that I like that, as I think that's the only thing that I'm like actively not a huge fan of in this game is like having to press the button over and over again to pick items up. Like just pick them up automatically. I shouldn't have to press R2. That's kind of silly. Uh, it's pretty fun so far. It's pretty fun so far. It's kind of got like, I don't want to say near Automata vibes, but that's kind of what it's giving me, kind of near Automata. Um, but it's pretty fun so far. With the scans kind of from like Horizon Zero Dawn kind of vibe too. That's where we're supposed to go. Can I go in here? Or is this locked from the other side? Locked. Okay. What if I just made it explode? Nope. Didn't move. Boom. Cool. That would have been helpful for that fight, by the way. What's back here? Hello. This is another one of the beta cores. Oh, a body core, which increases max HP. Nice. Hello. A supply camp in a place like this. Supply camp? What's that? It's a depot set up depot? by the airborne squad who came here before. Hmm. Looks like it's been abandoned for a long time. How come they set up a camp in a corner like this? Well, the supply camp also serves as an important base. Is this parking lot important? It could also mean that this place is very dangerous. Oh dear. Great. I'm ready. Then I guess this place could be useful for us. That's one way to describe it. I don't know if I'd go that far, but hey. Supply camps feature more devices than regular camps. You can use the repair console here to enhance weapons, increase the rechargeable tumbler count, or an, and upgrade your exospines and upgrade Eve's combat capabilities. Also, you can upgrade your drone, craft nano suits, and fast travel to other camps. Dope. All right, never mind. We like this one. Look at that. It's got a little like hot pot in the middle. Activate. Press R2 to change to the survival tree. Select blink. Can only be used when an enemy is attempting a fatal attack. Dodges and teleports behind the enemy. Well, that would have been useful. Darn it. <laughs> Select skill at the kiosk and to train it. You can also try out skills you haven't learned yet. If you're not used to combat, try increasing your proficiency with various skills through training. Okay. When, a counter, when an enemy glows blue and attempts a fatal attack, use blink to counter it. Okay. Up and circle and Eve's swords glow. Eve's sword glows. Okay. Okay. So wait until you see the sword glow. Like that. Sick. Next. I'm good. Easy enough. Sword glowy up circle. Got it. Repair console. So this is the thing that will help us upgrade our skills, right? Oh, we have a weapon core. Okay. Attack power increased from 450 to 490. Nope. We've only got one Omni Bolt and none of the Tumblr expansion modules yet. There's going to be other characters, it looks like. See how it says Eve and there's an L1 R1 next to it? Adam? Eve? Yeah. About yesterday. Thank you for saving me. It's only been a day? That's nothing, really. Though I have used up almost all of the exospine materials that I collected over the years. Oh. It's all right. That now means we can help each other. Sure. We can track down the Alpha Nativa together. And, well, I'd have trouble making it out here by myself anyway. Fair. If you can locate the Hall of Records, you'll have done more than enough. Listen, I am... don't worry. Oh, I wait. promise, I'll make sure to repay you. I had this issue with, um, Dealfield Chronicles, for what it's worth. Where, um... 
they kind of like glance over story bit and narrative i'm guessing what they assumed was for the sake of time but like this kind of um glancing over like conversation pieces stuff like that and just kind of doing it via flashbacks can be done very very well or very very poorly and right now this one's teetering on the edge for me i don't like when they uh as somebody that really enjoys plot heavy um games i don't enjoy when they like try to skip over that stuff not not my favorite yeah it's just it's just odd it doesn't stop me from enjoying the game or enjoying what i'm playing but just weird that's not an ordinary enemy no it's got a thunder sword sick adam get back Okay. That worked on accident. Hold on, please. Okay. The music is very good, yeah. Oh, sheesh. Time events really in 2024? Come on. Sick. Gruesome. Oh, is that it? Hey, and for what it's worth, that was a lot of fun. I really enjoyed that. That was a good time. I enjoyed that quite a bit. Boss challenge has been unlocked. Well. Well. Look, I'm in a different outfit. I'm ready. My goodness. <laughs> Lord. Hello. That's fine. Biotic field generator. That is recovery effects within a set range. Okay. Oh, 
Oh, I'm... Didn't realize my health was low. <laughs> maybe I should, maybe I should move the chat up a little bit so I can see my HP. <laughs> Whoopsie doodle. Jesus. Got him. Nice. Oh, quick time events again. Can't just let me enjoy the cutscene, huh? Dang. Let's go. Fantastic finish. You've defeated the boss. We did it. That was fun. So the combat really has an opportunity to like really level up and go super, super fun. That was that was really cool to see like kind of what the high high skill ceiling was. And obviously, I did not play that as well as I could have. But like having uh having the opportunity to like see a what a full build kind of looks like against a, a harder difficulty boss with some of the other skills involved too. That was fun. That was fun. Did want to take this opportunity to let the folks that are watching or that are scrolling by right now, we do have a charity stream happening next Saturday and Sunday over on my Twitch channel and my YouTube channel if you're interested in checking that out. So if you're interested in checking us out, make sure you give us a follow, give, a, give the channel a follow. You'll enjoy the stuff we do. We do a lot of fun stuff, a lot of variety, lots of Final Fantasy content on the Twitch channel right now. Lots of retro games over on the YouTube. Appreciate everybody tuning in. Hope you all have a great rest of your day. And as always, we'll see you again in the next one. Have a great day, everybody. Bye.